WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. And I am tracking a big time temperature drop as we head through the next couple of days, all courtesy of this cold front that has pushed through our area. We're talking about the potential for some frost and freeze advisories, a couple of mornings in the forecast, even a stray flurry out in Western Maryland in the cards uh, as we head through the next uh, 48 hours. I think the bigger story here is that we'll eventually start to get out of this little cool down as we head towards the weekend. The temperatures are going to get into more agreeable territory. Just have to deal with some chilly morning starts here, and I know that some of you may have not shuffle the closet around yet, but this is going to be the time to go ahead and find those thicker coats as temperatures are going to be in the mid to upper 30s to start off the next few mornings. Well below that 45 degree seasonal average that we have through the rest of the work week. Things don't get back above normal until the weekend. So thankfully, whenever everyone's looking to get out and about, we'll see some sunshine. Meanwhile, sunshine uh, with the uh, winds coming out of the west through the day tomorrow. A couple of high clouds through the afternoon. Keeping things dry, but you can see that area of low pressure swirling uh, to the north and west of our area. Lots of residual moisture, lots of snow flurries moving through the Ohio River Valley. Some of that will make its way into Western Maryland as we head into Wednesday morning, but we're keeping things dry through the day tomorrow. Just going to be a cold start. Hot coffee, green light, 39 degrees at the 7 o'clock hour, getting into the lower 40s through 9, getting into more manageable territory as we head into the afternoon, but this is not what we want to see. Low 50s is well below average for the afternoon. We top out at about 55 degrees, normal number 68 degrees, so we're 13 degrees cooler than average, and it's going to be a chilly afternoon, so you're going to need those sleeves all day. The numbers fall back into the upper 40s as we head into the evening, and we're looking at clear skies, so that means another night where radiational cool Cooling is going to send those numbers down. You saw those few specks of blue out in Western Maryland before 7 a.m. That's our uh, snow chance uh, looking at numbers that are going to be at or below freezing from Bel Air all the way into Thermont. Some upper 20s is going to be possible in the city of Baltimore. We'll get into the upper 40s as we head into the 12 o'clock hour, but we're only into the 50s for a few hours. We're struggling to get into the low to mid 50s on Wednesday afternoon, so another very chilly day. Clear skies through the overnight, so once again, the numbers tumble. It's especially north and west of the city. We continue to see temperatures that are below freezing, so that means we could see more freeze warnings as we head into the start of your Thursday morning. Start to see things get a little bit milder as we head into the afternoon, getting into the mid to upper 50s, and things don't really get into the 60s until Friday, where we're looking at daytime highs near 64 degrees. Thankfully, a warming trend is going to take hold for the weekend, upper 60s Saturday and Sunday. A few more clouds by Monday, daytime highs still just shy of 70. We'll be right back.